Also in the third round, a, a defensive tackle that uh, we've talked about before, Siaka Ika uh, from Baylor. What do you like with him? Well, he's a guy, you know, I kind of, he doesn't fit last year's defense in terms of an anchor, but for what the Browns have added with Dalvin Thompson, you know, he's a guy who uh, started off at LSU, then went to Baylor. Last year he had 20 tackles, 15 quarterback hurries, which tells you he can rush the quarterback a little bit. Um, he's a massive guy, so he'll combine. He was 335 back on, in January when you and I talked. He was 358, so he fluctuates. He's a big body guy, 6'3". He's got a lot of natural ability. He's got some good short area burst. Um, sometimes I would say the reason he slid to the third round is that he always doesn't play to his size. So here you're going to see him. He's going to attack. He's going to push this guy back and use his leverage. He sometimes doesn't use that leverage. Now, I think he's a perfect fit now with Dalvin Thompson because Dalvin Thompson will now get the double teams. But this is a guy who can get in a gap. And that, those big body guys, they are so hard to stop once they get moving, uh, especially when they're just taking a gap. So he's a guy who's going to create pressure. He might be a rotational guy early, but he's a guy with Dalvin Thompson on the other side. He could be really successful. Again, for the scheme, this late you know, late third round, this is a really good value pick. And, and um, a guy that you know Jim Schwartz likes based on how they interacted uh, when the Browns were letting him know they drafted him.